A proposal in Stevens Point could change city leadership. Good evening, I'm Eric Morotek. Melissa is off. Now, this proposal could change the mayor's full-time position into a part-time role while creating a full-time city administrator. News 9's Adriana Daniel joins us with more on what that could mean. For decades, the city of Stevens Point has had a full-time mayor position. But now, Council President Mark Christensen has put up this discussion item that could change all of that. How did you feel when you saw this, when this email got sent out? I thought it was a little sudden. Council President Christensen this week requested this document be added to next week's meeting agenda, titled Discussion and Consideration of Part-Time Mayor, Full-Time City Administrator System for Stevens Point. The document outlined different forms of city government, how different municipalities in the state organize their leadership, and a myth sheet. All of this coming out of the blue to Mayor Mike Wiesa, and he says there's a lot of questions left to be answered, like how do you fund it? That money's going to have to come from somewhere. If we can't afford police officers and firefighters and streets employees, where does that money come from? And you can't leave the administrator uh, without some sort of administrative staff. So you have to hire another full-time person to be support, at least one. According to the document submitted to the clerk's office, states the salary for administrators can range between seventy-five dollars and $225,000, with the average being $123,000. And according to the document, in some small counties in the state, the administrator position is combined with the clerk or the clerk treasurer position and potentially other. The council will be discussing this item on Monday, July 8th, at the committee meeting. Reporting in Stevens Point, I'm Adriana Daniel, News 9, WAOW.